welcome everybody to a special episode of Factorio. Right, so I didn't want to put this into like the main series or main, you know, the main thing. I want to ask you guys, I'm going to release this early, so probably like Monday. And I have released obviously the two on the weekend. And then this one's going to be a follow up for the next week. Uh, right, so if we if we scroll out we've got our base here like and i want to give you guys like i'm going to pause i'm going to give you guys a no i'm actually i'm not going to pause because it's going to look weird uh i'm going to give you guys a breakdown so why i put the base here right is because there was water up here and that's where i've tapped into and then i've brought it down and like i've got my copper on that side my coal here and my iron here and i thought oh that's cool it's all within the base it's great but i've realized that I need to make the base bigger, obviously, and the factory must grow and stuff like that. So what I'm thinking in stones down here is what I'm thinking is I'm going to leave this one as as I'm going, right? And leave it, leave it going and then I can dismantle it or I can do whatever later on. But what I'm thinking is if I go to map, I've chucked a quick temporary wall up here and a radar. Right, so I was thinking up here is where I'm going to put the main base because there's nothing... There's nothing around except for uranium which i could always track down or whatever like you know with a train or something like that the closest iron mine is here which i'm probably gonna have to tap into sooner or later because that thing has only got 156k left in it uh which is not a lot when you think about it hmm i might have to think about that i haven't ever actually hovered over oh there's a 3.7 million there could could track that up to the train and the train could bring it over <gasps> maybe uh and then we've got iron there which is 2.1 2.1 oh there's baddies over there okay baddies here and they're just getting sidetracked by the way these guys are going to be a problem because these guys are going to cause problems this way anyway what i'm doing is up here this is where i'm thinking the main base will be and what i was thinking is see i've put three of sorry four tracks so i was thinking one for copper one for what the hell am i talking about one for copper one for iron one for stone and one for coal and bring them up in a line up and into the base and then split them off before they get there you know like so like hey, bring it up here and then do splits here and then just make everything out from there does that sound right like i don't know what would you guys do like obviously i want to i want to do i want to do me but i was thinking is it is it worth it like making a whole new base up here or should i just carry on with this bad boy but eventually i guess this is going to run out this is going to run out i'm going to have to think about how i'm going to bring things in in my head while I was not sleeping the other night, uh, I was thinking that I might put like a uh, a train depot here that unloads everything. So everything like this will come over to the train depot. Uh, this stuff will come over to the train depot. Everything will come. Ooh. Go, 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 go. Good work, Terry. Good work. Uh, everything will come to a train depot. And then I could obviously chuck them on the belts and then send them up here and into the main base. What do you guys reckon? Like... <laughs> that's what i want to do and then i want to probably like you know split it out into like maybe like sections you know how like like workers or factories or whatever have sections so this is the the production section and this is the resource section and this is the you know all that is it just me or am i just being a big nerd or should i uh <laughs> should i do something a little bit different why did i do that oh yeah that's right <clears throat> i'm going up here uh, while I'm talking so I'm going to quickly go like that so yeah so I was thinking of bringing all the four belts up here and then obviously there might be a fifth belt later on which will be what would it be fifth belt would be uranium because that's the only one I can think of right now because it's right there and I could bring that down and truck it in or oil oil would probably come up maybe in a pipe oh no because someone said something about pipes that they reduce over time so maybe maybe I'll maybe i'll truck that up in barrels maybe that's easier uh or a train uh right we're gonna go and repair this wall just because i keep pulling them into my inventory and they're always broken so let's quickly do that so do do do, do. i'm holding down thanks to meg and thanks to wait was it meg hold on let me bring up this good here go away tree there we go okay hold on let me bring up this good and we will find out who i need to thank for the day well, obviously first one is thank you thank you to my beautiful wife she is awesome she helps me along with all the episodes she gives me encouragement and i love her to pieces thank you very much now with the other ones i wanted to say th thank uh squidiot they're cool ren i want to thank you too and uh 
Right, hold on, let me disable the usernames. Uh, the Super Pickle, very cool. And Bash Meg, that was it, cool. So Bash Meg, gotcha, awesome. You guys are the ones that are commenting in the Discord. Uh, sorry if I was talking and I'm over, off to the side, I might edit that if it's not very loud. Uh, but you guys are the ones that are commenting all the time in the Discord and I appreciate it. And I appreciate you guys trying to help me as well. Obviously, there's all you guys who are commenting as well, and I I thank you throughout the comments of YouTube and stuff like that. Uh, if you're not in the Discord, jump in the Discord. It's really cool. Got a big community in there. I say big, it's like under 50, but it's still a big community for me anyway. But um, but yeah. So, what do you guys reckon? What's your guys' thoughts on my idea of doing this? And then just trucking it up here. And I could probably do that in offline video. Or did you want to? Did you want to see it? in an online video and I just remake it all. Uh, is that good content for you guys? Like, uh, I don't know, like, is it good? Is it not good? Uh, I might put a door between there. Da -da -da -da. Just at the moment, because obviously I'm going to, that's not even a door. <laughs> Actually it is, I need to go this way. <laughs> right, get rid of this. Uh, yeah, so this is just gonna be like a five, 10 minute video. Uh, just talking to you guys about what do you think I should do? And then we shall we shall obviously go with it. And yeah, if, if your guys comments, if you comment, great. If you don't, that's fine. Uh, we'll just play along and, and just keep going. But rebuilding it so it's more like efficient, maybe maybe a good idea. Uh, but I do like my higgledy piggledy factory. It's it's great, you know. Like I just tap into things. But see, I'm running out of I'm running out of steel pipes. Well, I'm not running out of them, but they're going very slow. It's because I'm tapping into them more. And so making a bigger one of these would be probably good. Uh, which I could could maneuver all the way over here. But why? Why would I do that when I could just truck it up here and make a whole new one? Like why make a new one here? I could just truck it up there. So yeah. All right. You guys, let me know. Oh, there's something else to be repaired. I think you are a special lamp post no uh it's a power pole i think you were the one that i backed into in the car in the first episode so i'm gonna repair you there we go could oh and that light i think that light's a special one as well <laughs> special near and dear awesome all right i'm gonna quickly go around and repair everything while i'm here but you guys have a good rest of your monday or sunday or when are you whenever you are that you're watching oh my god there's so much damage over here uh whenever you're watching this because I appreciate you guys, and you guys are doing a bang up job by watching this crazy Kiwi have a go at playing Factoria, and I'm loving it. The game is freaking awesome. Uh, why aren't you repairing? Hello? Oh, because that's not the one. Awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm having a blast playing this. I'm having a blast talking to you guys and learning, and it's such a fun game. So if you haven't played Factorio and you want to play Factorio, man, it's a cool game. It's worth the money buying this blooming game it's so cool so uh and this one i did buy didn't get it at oh, you i backed into you as well i didn't uh didn't get this one for free or anything like that i brought it with my own hard earned money of market making and sword making and stuff like that so if you don't know what i'm talking about jump on the discord have a look in the place that says what i do in a day and you will see what i mean all right you guys have a good rest of your night day whatever and i will see you in the next video bye